crew welcome back to the channel today's video will be seafood cajun alfredo so we have our uh, alfredo sauce here have fettuccine noodles we have one stick up imperial margarine we have tony sashimi's creole seasoning obey seasoning shrimp and crawfish and if you're new to the channel and seeing this please subscribe to the channel click the bell set post notifications to all like the videos and comment on the video let's get into this video all right crew so hey we have baby girl we're gonna take cooking today hey she's gonna use some tony sasha creole seasoning and some old bay seasoning okay go ahead baby girl and season that thing up like you'll season your man okay 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 <laughs> <laughs> Shake it. Shake it, shake it. Aha, <laughs> <laughs> you dropped the shrimp. <laughs> and she just mixing up the shrimp. Alright, so she's gonna go in with four tablespoons of Imperial margin. Which will be a half a stick, y'all. And we gonna let that butter out. It's not a melt, 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 melt. Okay, so she's just gonna add some shrimp in there. And she's gonna let these saute up. Look at these babies. And y'all know how to saute shrimp. You know, use whatever season you want to use your favorite uh, Cajun or Creole seasoning and make it your own. I dare you to eat one. No, no. Ain't nothing but sushi. I'm good. I don't want nothing wrong. Well, I do like sushi, but I'm not eating no shrimp, bro. I don't like sushi. Have you tried it? Nope. Okay, Nathaniel Jr. asked me if I try stuff. Okay, y'all, let us know in the comment section below if you like sushi. And if you don't, have you ever tried it? And if you do, let us know what's your favorite sushi to uh, eat. Alright, okay. If y'all never tried it, is it because you don't like the way it looks? Because if I don't like the way that my food looks, I don't eat it. Right. Or is it because it's raw? I don't know. I think it's just because of the way it looks. Jordan said I can't do stuff yet on camera. No idea. I'm ready for the crawfish to go in here. Ooh. And yeah, y'all, this is the first uh, batch of shrimp. Um, I'm gonna let her cook the second shrimp. And when she's gonna do the crawfish, I'll bring you guys back. And get in there, look at them shrimp. Brianna okay. can cook when she wants. So I'm gonna bring you guys back when she put the crawfish in there. I'm gonna do my crawfish on my address. That butter that I use for the shrimp. And we still got that shrimp juice in there for the seasoning. Yep. And then I got these crawfish tails. And they're fully cooked. So she's gonna go in with the crawfish and all the juices that's in there too. Oh, that looks so good. I can just eat a bag. <laughs> All of it out. It smells good. Oh. And she's gonna go in with the same seasoning, y'all. Yeah, so I'm gonna put some Tony. I'm gonna put some Old Bay. So chop her up. Cause she has a little cold in the middle. Baby girl makes really good Alfredo and uh, really good spaghetti. I'm trying to learn how to cook so I can cook for my man. 
If you didn't hear that, she's trying to learn how to cook so she can cook for her man. She already know how to cook, y'all. Well, the crawfish already been cooked, y'all. Y'all don't have to saute, saute those long in the butter. Because you can tell how the tails are starting to curl already. That means they're ready. Look at that one. She's so pretty. Yeah, it smells good. Okay, so now I'm going to add my shrimp in with my crawfish. We're going to mix them up. She's going to add one stick of inferior margarine. Whoopsie! She dropped the paper in there too. Hold the paper, my love. Okay. And we have three cans of Alfredo. And then we got some. We got shake, shake. <laughs> Can number two. Just put can number two. And then you go. Jar number two in there. You gotta get all the liquid out. And y'all, uh, uh, help a tip. Add milk to your jar. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do that last. So I'm gonna add a little milk to this jar and shake it, and then pour it in this jar and shake it. And pour it in this jar right. And shake it. Cool. Bay. Yeah, Obey. That's bae. my Obey. Bay, not B A E. <laughs> bay, like the Bay. Yeah. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Yeah. Then we're gonna take some Tony. You know, off of girlfriends. We gonna shake. Add her some flavor. Margarine, to be correct, to be exact. Add it to the water, and then my family likes salt, so I'm gonna do. That. And guys, when you salt your water for noodles, make sure you season it just like the ocean salt water. And don't salt your water until your water starts boiling, because if you salt your water before the water starts boiling, it's gonna take longer for it to boil. And then I want some fettuccine. So we got some garlic bread to go with our seafood Cajun Alfredo. And I'm gonna put this in the oven at 425 degrees. Okay, right, cool. So here's the final look of our seafood Alfredo. And if you're seeing this and you like the video, please subscribe to the channel. 
click the bell set post notifications to all like the videos and comment on each and every video give y'all a close up here and y'all already know the saying pops out peace